All right. Good morning. I want to thank you for taking the time out of your, your, your mornings to uh, attend the, today's webinar. We're going to be discussing the uh, value added benefit of dental that is, you know, included with your MyCare HMO plan through Western Health Advantage. My name is Eric Greathouse, and I am a Medicare sales representative uh, with Western Health. And uh, a little housekeeping, if you have questions, and I know we've already actually received a question that we'll try to address toward the end of the, of the presentation. This presentation won't be all that long, um, you know, so maybe 15, 20, 20 minutes, perhaps 25 minutes, and then we'll get to uh, your questions. So if you find your chat box or even the Q&A box, as you move your mouse around, you might see at the bottom of the screen, that's where you can type in your questions. And those questions, just the panelist uh, we'll see those. So they're not like public. Um, so you have, you know, privacy in, in the question that you're asking. So with that, we'll go and get started. All right. Let me uh, see why in the world my screen isn't moving again. Now, Raymond, I'm at the lower left corner and I don't see the little arrows there like I did before. Uh, just click on to the thing. Now you see it there. Yep. It should be yep, right there. There it is. Got it. Thank you, Raymond. Sorry about that. Okay. So um, today we're very privileged to have with us uh, a representative. Her name is Kim Kuwahara from Delta Dental that will be actually the main presenter of our of our presentation today regarding these, these dental benefits. So with that, Kim, um, please go ahead and introduce yourself. Thanks, Eric. Hi, everyone. My name is Kim Kuwahara, and I'm the account manager um, with Delta Dental that works with the Western Health Advantage. So I'm pleased to be here this morning to kind of um, review how your dental plan works. So today we'll talk about who is Delta Dental, in case you haven't heard of us, um, kind of the benefits of the plan, the member experience, and some tools um, that are available to you and um, any questions that you might have. Next slide. Okay. Next slide, please. So who is Delta Dental? Um, we are the largest provider of dental benefits in the country. We have over a million Medicare Advantage members. Um, a lot of you might've had coverage with us when you were in your working days, um, dental is our only uh, specialty, and we have nearly 80 million uh, enrollees in our in our plans. Next slide, please. So now let's talk about um, the Western Health Plan. Um, this is a DHMO plan. Um, it's fully owned by us. And within the, the plan, you are assigned to a dentist that manages all of the care that you need. So that is assigned when you join um, and you can change that um, dentist whenever you would like on our customer service, by calling customer service or by going online to the microsite, which is listed there. Um, the specialty care is provided through referrals by your primary dentist. So that dentist is managing all of your care for you. Um, the, oh, sorry. Uh, members must use network providers except in case of an emergency. So just to kind of mention that. So, so, so some of the advantages of the, the DHMO include uh, co-payments. So you have predictable costs. So you know what, um, the service that you need is going to cost you. There's no deductibles, there's no maximums, there's no claim forms. Um, it's very easy to use because of those things and it provides you some affordable benefits. The Western Health Plan does provide you with a very nice benefit, um, including no copay for um, services like cleanings, oral exams, x-rays, basically your preventive type of care, there's zero copay for you when you're accessing those services. Next slide. Um, in terms of your assigned dentist, um, this is auto assigned based on your home address. Um, the changes that you might need to make to your dentist can be made um, via calling customer service or online. Changes made by the 21st of the month are effective on the first of the following month. Um, and there's no limit of 
of the number of times that you can change your dentist. If for some reason you're not happy with, with the dentist that you're going to, you can change it. And then a few months later, you could change it again. It's really up to you. Hopefully you don't have to do that, but it, that option is available to you. In terms of the member experience, um, let's look at how the DHMO works. Um, as I mentioned, um, you are assigned a primary care dentist or you've chosen one yourself by changing it online or by phone. You just go ahead and make your appointment, visit your dentist and pay any copayment if there's any. So it's really pretty easy to access um, services. If you need specialty care, your primary care dentist will refer you. Um, they take care of any authorizations and you also can go out of network if there was an emergency. So again, that dentist will take care of basically anything that you need, your, your, all your dental care. You do get an ID card, um, but you're not required to have that ID card to receive treatment. Um, the dentist should have your information available to them. Um, you're also mailed a welcome letter. So that's how you know who the assigned provider is. And the copay schedule um, is av available on the microsite um, that I'll show you in a second um, so that you know what, what you would need to pay for various services. Um, listed here is the toll-free number for Western Health Advantage. Um, customer service support is available if there's questions about claims, who is my dentist, um, what's the coverage for a certain procedure, um, any type of, of question that you have, um, you're able to call customer service. We also have bilingual support as well and language assistance available if it was needed um, during an appointment um, that you might have. So we're definitely here to help help you out. There's also a dedicated, um, we call it microsite. It's really just a website for Western Health. You can view your benefits. You can search for dentists. Um, you can create a profile. Um, it's pretty easy. And you can go in and see your claims and all that type of um, information that you might need. You, we also have a mobile app where you can also access information and find dentists. Um, there's also a cost estimator for common services. There's quizzes, videos, dental health information. So that's available to you as well. This is kind of a snapshot of what the microsite looks like. I just screenshot the find a dentist page. So as you can see, it's pretty easy. You just put in a zip code and do a search and you'll be able to find dentists available to you if you did want to change your dentist. There's also information about your plan um, and um, a summary of the copays, as I mentioned as well. Um, oral health and wellness is very important, as we know, especially for seniors. Um, we have a lot of information available for you online. There's risk assessments, articles, videos magazines, recipes, risk assessments, everything that you need if you have, are curious about oral, oral wellness. Um, there's 100 plus articles on everything from acid reflux to x-rays, um, healthy aging, um, there's videos, um, there's risk assessments. So again, resources there for you. Um, on that. We also have a newsletter that you can sign up for to learn fun facts and tooth friendly recipes. You can sign up by email and you can get a new issue every season and it's also available in Spanish. And that's, that's what I have to tell you about the, the dental plan. And I'm happy to take questions, Eric. We're, were you going to monitor the chat or? Yes, I, I am. And there was there was a question. Um, okay. Yeah. Does the plan support ongoing supplies for dentures? 
Um, I would have to pull the plan design and, and look at that and get back to you on that. Okay. All right. So th that, that'd be great. And then um, uh, I'll be able to get in so touch with. In terms yeah. of. So the, the person that asked the question, once I get the information from, from Kim, uh, I'll be reaching out to you. If you could uh, type in your email address to me so that I have that information or Raymond, we might have it from the pre-registration. Is that correct? All the, uh, the attendees emails. Yes, we should have all the emails. Okay. All right. So uh, the person that asked a question about supporting ongoing supplies for, for dentures, um, I'll, I'll be getting back to you after the webinar. Okay. Um, so Kim, I actually have a question that could be beneficial to those on, on the webinar today. Um, whenever someone's, you know, brand new uh, to Western Health and they have this included, you know, Delta Dental and they want to go to the dentist for the first time, uh, they, it's not just as simple as showing up at a dentist that they found on that website. They actually need to call first to get maybe on the dentist roster to know that that's going to be a patient of that office. Is that how that works? No, we, um, we take care of that. Once that dentist is assigned, um, the dentists have access to, um, provider tools online. So they have access to eligibility as well as we send them a roster of who signed up for for their office. So that's kind of how it works. And then it, to access services, you would need to call the office and make an appointment. Um, and then that dentist can take care of you. Okay, fantastic. Thank you. Yeah, we just had another question come in. Uh, is this the same plan for Kaiser? You know, if you're on Medicare? The same plan for Kaiser? Yeah, I think Kaiser has a Delta Dental benefit that might be I don't know, maybe perhaps a PPO, but this is a, an, a dental HMO. Um, Kaiser is one of our clients. I don't know off the top of my head what, I, I definitely know they have a DHMO as well. Um, okay. Okay. The PPO too, they're pretty big. So I, that, they're not my group. So I'm not positive what they have. Okay. So, but, but maybe, maybe the question, if, you know, is this the same plan for Kaiser? It is Delta Dental. So if that answers the question, Yes, this is Delta Dental, uh, and I believe Kaiser also, as Kim has stated, has Delta Dental. Right. Okay. All right. Any other questions uh, from any of the, the attendees before we wrap things up here? Hi, Kim. Okay. This is Elisa with... Um... Western Health in our Medicare sales department as well. Another question we get a lot from members or prospective members is about dental implants. Um, I believe that's one benefit that isn't covered under our plan, is that correct? I don't think it is, no. I don't think so. I would have to check for sure. You're, I don't have the schedule in front of me, but I can, um, I can check. I don't think it is though. Yeah, I tend to agree, uh, Kim and Lisa, that it, implants is, is not a covered benefit. If you did want to, you know, look look at adding something like that, we could definitely look at that with um, in terms of adding it. Yeah, that that have to be something we would have to it'd be, you know, and and if it were added, it wouldn't be obviously this year; it'd be in uh, for the future plan years. Yeah. Okay. All right. Um, well, I do believe that was all the questions, Kim. Thank you so much for uh, joining us today and presenting the Delta Dental HMO. That one again, one of the value-added benefits uh, that is included with the MyCare plan. And with that, uh, you guys go ahead and have the rest of your day. And again, thank you for for attending. Stay safe, everyone. Thank you. Bye bye.